On Monday, senators embarked on a historic sitting in Wasingishu County, a first of its kind 10 years after the promulgation of the new constitution. The lawmakers mingling and sharing experiences with their county counterparts, an experience that the Senate hopes to extend to other counties. The senators held a joint sitting with a section of members of the Wasingishu County Assembly to exchange notes on how the two assemblies can improve engagements to help steer devolution. And we hope through the leadership of the speaker that the facilities that you have given us will be able to remain with us so that we can continue enjoying them. But amid the pleasantries, the lawmakers expressed their disapproval over the 9 billion shilling reduction to the county budget reallocation by the National Assembly. If there is any cutbacks, those cutbacks should only be applied to the national government and should not affect the county government. Finance and Budget Committee Chair Mahmoud Mohammed accusing the executive of being a habitual lawbreaker. We have heard in the press that uh, the revenue, the revenue, I mean, uh, the revenue of the county is going to be by about nine billion. You can only do that if you have changed the division of revenue act. You cannot legislate in the National Assembly through appropriation, uh, which is supplementary appropriation, to change, to change money of the county. That's illegal actually in the constitution. Senate Speaker Kenneth Lusaka continued with his onslaught against those calling for the dissolution of the Senate, arguing that such a move will negate every effort ever put in place to ensure devolution yields desired results. Those who are imagining that uh, they can just wake up and scrape Senate are they dreaming and they belong to the past. We cannot go backwards. Lusaka challenged MCAs to invigorate the war against graft in the counties so that Kenyans can get value for their money. I served as a governor and therefore I know when I sit here now as a speaker, I understand both sides of the coin. And you can count on us, you can count on my leadership. And I'm happy that this has happened during my time. This week, the senators will be holding their plenary and committee sittings in Wasingishu County with issues touching on agriculture and health expected to feature prominently. For Channel 1 News, I am Edward Kabasa.